Hello everyone, this is Thomas here, and welcome back to another Axe Thomas Esteem Team, episode 93. Summer 2024 is about to be over, which tomorrow will be the last day of summer, and fall is about to be coming after two days. But anyhow, let's, let's start the questions, shall we? Alright, let's get started. The first one we have here is Brendan Light 3719. He has five questions, bonus questions. One, are you ready for the first day of fall 2024? Yes. Which starts on September 22nd, 2024, which is Sunday. Two, who is your favorite character from Rockco's Modern Life? I'll say Rockco. Three, has everyone ever seen that it was the truth about Toby? Yes. I heard about like rumors about Toby is getting scrapped. But that was not even true. Toby was Toby had run out of coal. When when Toby was delivering some scrap to Reg, he ran out of coal. But that's the episode called The Truth About Toby. But I'm glad that Toby was safe. But if you're asking about how's Toby, Toby is fine. He's doing fine. Four, when you are meeting new people and there is one missing, who else was it? Maybe a... Maybe a guest? Imagine if you are having a picnic with your friends and you discover that someone forgot about the drink how should you handle the situation? Well, if they forgot all the drinks, maybe I should fetch some drinks. But if they're, if Naffer Station has some drinks, maybe I can go to Naffer Station and get one of the drinks and take it to the picnic. That would be interesting. Did Arthur Reed ever punch DW before? Yes, he did, and he got in trouble for that. That's the episode called called Arthur's Big Hit. Just like the episode when DW do something wrong with Arthur's stuff, it made Arthur very angry, and Arthur was so furious at DW for about DW destroying his stuff. He got really angry and he, he started punching him and Arthur's mom and dad got very upset at Arthur, which which is not really good. And Arthur's dad told him that he, Arthur could not watch TV anymore because due to this problem. But thankfully that Arthur say sorry to DW and DW actually say sorry to order about the the plane, the orange plane that that you ever saw. But keep it even though even though Arthur had admitted his mistake. That's the episode. Like I said, that episode is called Arthur's Big Hit. All right. Next we have here is Stephanie. Balson slash N5B-V. One, what's your opinion on Thomas as Light McQueen? Well, my opinion as me as Light McQueen, fantastic. Two, what's your opinion on James as Light McQueen? Hmm, pretty splendid. And three, what's your opinion on Gordon as Light McQueen? Pretty pretty good next we have here is as greeny swan thousand six hundred sixty five one what's your opinion on Vion? well I'm not interested in Vion. I prefer YouTube way better than this 
because I know a lot of people having a lot of complaints about Vion, even though, even though, in my opinion on Vion, I'm, I'm not interested. But if you guys like, like Vion, that's fine by me. I just prefer using YouTube. Two, what's your opinion on Nigel News? Never heard of it. Three, what's your opinion on Thomas Toy Trains? I, I, I seen that user who makes that, makes Thomas content. In my opinion, um, he's cool. Four, what's your opinion on parodies? They're cool. And five, what's your opinion on Jars 111S? Um, great YouTuber. Even though he's not active. Although, I know people are starting to miss that user because even though he's not active on YouTube for like years, he has... He hasn't been using YouTube for a long time. I know people are, are starting to miss him. Next we have here is Perry the Sprite Team 2. He asks, can tank engines go backwards and forwards instead of using the turntable? Absolutely. Just like me and Percy. And there were some tank engines. I don't need a turntable because I can go backwards and forwards. But the tender engines need turntables because it's very dangerous to to go fast backwards. But I can show you how I go backwards and forwards once I'm after I'm I'm done I'm done with um Pennsylvania on the river when I get back from Pennsylvania. Next we have here is Nyla and Salin the Sprite Team. And they ask, are you gonna do something different on your channel? Well yes. Well I just like to do something different on my channel because um you know what I mean. Next we have here is Toby the Tram Engine 7 slash R7F. And he asks, What's your opinion on up storm scene? It was terrifying, even though I like, I like Up the movie. Next we have here is Tom the Sprite Team 1. He asks, does fuel tankers catch fire? Yes. They, they did catch on fire. Just like how when James was pulling the, the fuel tankers, when one of the James's field tanker was leaking, and all of a sudden, it caught on fire. Yeah, fuel tankers are very dangerous stuff. Yeah, don't ever, don't be careful while pulling fuel tankers because if you, if you're one of the sparks get into the tankers, that can actually start a fire. James, you, James. Yeah, last time James has having trouble with the fuel tankers. So yeah, the fuel tankers did catch on fire. Next we have here is Donald the Scottish Engine 9 slash P7G. He asks, what's your opinion on a close shape for Doug? Pretty good episode. Next we have here is Sabrina Greeny 7520. He asked, What's your opinion on Mathis Deep Pabimus episode Gordon's Grumbling? I seen that episode, but but I have to give it a watch. But in my opinion on Gordon's Grumbling, it's a pretty alright episode. I know that that Gordon is really out of character in this episode. Next we have here is Kimberly Martin Picard 751. And she asks, what's your opinion on James Goes Buzz Buzz where James gets stung by a bee? Well, 
pretty splendid episode, but James gets stung by a bee. Oh, that could be a lot of pain. Yeah, James got stung by a bee. If you're asking about did James get stung by a bee, yes, he actually did. When James accidentally wished steamed one of the bees, one of the bees got really got really mad and and they got into James's nose. Yep. Yeah, the bee stung James on the nose here. Next we have here is Maze Greeny and he asked, "What's your opinion on Toy Story 3?" Um Pretty cool sequel movie. Next we have here is again, Kimberly Morton Pickard 751. She asked, what's your opinion on Jeremy's Crypto video, An Engine That Could Fly? Probably a good, pretty good episode. Even though that that's, that's a big boy engine actually could fly. Even though trains don't ever fly because I'm too heavy to fly. Next we have here is Percy the Small Engine Product P-A-B. And he asked, what's your opinion on Keeping Up With James? Um, pretty cool episode. But even though that James and once when James and, and Ever were working together, James could be actually very impatient. But good thing that James says, but good thing that James finally learned his lesson about being patient and he has to slow down and take care and last but not least we have here is Sabrina Granny 7865 it's 36 excuse me and he asked do you like Max the Thomas at Turning Red's fans 2004's live stream? Oh yeah, they're actually pretty cool. Alright everyone, that's it for this question we have here for today. If you have more questions to ask me, feel free to post comments below. If you're new to this channel, feel free to subscribe to me. But anyways, this is Thomas, see you later.